as you reach with the elbows, reach with the fingers. And then reach with the wrists, but don't move them. So as if you're reaching forward with the wrists, but you're not gonna move them. You're just gonna feel them pushing, feeling the, uh, the space in front of them. You can think of it as pushing the air, you can also think of it as pushing the space. Feel that, feel your wrists. And as you do that, notice the activity in your hands, in your arms. This is the filling. So we're using a simple three pillars standing posture to generate that sense of fullness. So we have boom or three pillars and we meet or feel and we fill. Now just do a very simple like an opening posture, uh, an opening movement in a, in a yawn form where you, you feel your elbows, reach with your elbows and feel the, the shoulders disengage as you do that by intentionally doing that. And then reach with your wrists and coming up with the wrists, letting your fingers hang, moving very, very slowly. Feel the space, feel your wrists, feeling the space. Feel the resistance there, feel the heaviness of your arms as you do this. Feel the heaviness of your fingers. Feel the fullness as you're very soon. And then reach out with your fingers. And as you do that, feel the space between your shoulder blades opening up. Feel that tautness there as you extend out, you're lengthening the tissue between your shoulder blades. Now feel the balls of your feet, set the knees and bow from the claw slightly. And as you do that, reach with the elbows. Elbows start to come down. Yes, bowing forward slightly. Feel your wrists now. Feel them pressing against the empty space and bend the wrists as they come down so the fingers are reaching up. Reaching with the wrists. So you get down and then straighten up. And as you do that, you reach down with the fingers. Feel the fullness in your hands. Feel the fullness in your, your entire body mind. Do that again. Feel the balls of the feet, set the knees, bow forward slightly. And as you bow forward, you reach with the elbows. Open the shoulders, open the shoulder gate, open the elbow gate and reach with the wrists. Relax the fingers. Feel that up and out energy, that expansion. Reach with the fingers, open between the shoulder blades. Reaching, feel the balls, set the knees, bow forward, reach with the elbows. Feel the wrists as if you're swimming through the air. Straighten up and reach down with the fingers. Feel the fullness. Now, 
sink into your left spiral down turn pivot on your right heel to the ball of the right foot set the right knee spiral down to the left so we're going to do a little pong now a little ward off very simplified there are probably a thousand different ways to do a ward off posture so this is just one of them but we're going to break it down it's, it's really it's most the simplest components that is we're going to go like this actually we're going to use a bring the, the left hand up so it'll be like more of a classic ward off with the with the right arm kind of a thing so bring the hand down so feel the ball set the knee spiral down to the left and as you spiral down to the left reach with the elbows you're loading up that right leg, spiraling down to the left, reaching with the elbows, opening the shoulder joints. Feel your index fingers. Feel the fullness in your hands. And then turn. And as you turn, you set the right elbow, set the left elbow. And reach with the wrist so as you're reaching up notice the hand is down and as it's coming up it's rotating so this is a key part of it so the wrist is reaching and turning the fingers are relaxed reach with both elbows both wrists and complete the turn and bring your left hand so that it's just facing the the palms of both hands are facing each other reaching with the elbows reaching with the wrists not forgetting the three pillars so everything is coming from that reaching with the crown of the head feeling the balls of the feet Feel the ball of the left foot, set the left knee, spiral down to the right, and then turn, open up and come down. Spiral, left ball, knee cross, spiral down. Feel the ball of the right foot, set the right knee, and then turn. As you turn, feel the elbows, feel the wrists. Feel that and fill. Allow that feeling to energize the whole system. Left ball, set the left knee, spiral down to the right, and then turn. Hands come down. Come up. Right ball, set the right knee, spiral down to the left, reach with the elbows. As you turn, feel the wrist, reach with the wrist. Feel that, feel it pressing against the space. So the substantial part of this is this thing here, where you setting the elbow, reach with the wrist. So you're doing this in, you're actually you're setting the elbow, reaching with the finger. So you're feeling the energetic coherence and then you, reach with the wrist. So there's this, this quality is happening, which then allows the tensegrity of the whole system. So you're not just pushing with your press or um, warding off with your forearm or your wrist, you're doing it with the earth. Everything is connected up and moving through that. One more time. Right ball, set the right knee, spiral down to the left, and then turn. You're reaching with the, with the elbows, feeling your index fingers, the energetic coherence, and feel with the wrists, fill. Rotate the forearm so the palm is out. And feel the 
the, the fullness, feel the energy filling up the whole structure there, the Pong Jin, which is animates the structure. Without that tensegrity, without that springy, springy connective tissue, you don't have anything. Without the energy, you don't have anything. It's the two together that make that thing work. Bring your arms down, pivot, step in, take a deep breath, and stir the cheek. 